The show has actually been going on for a whole year, and it's going to go on for another year at least. And I've been going all over LA County, visiting different schools and art spaces, and showing these 10 images that 10 different artists can see lots of different cool images to me. Each one is I selected with the idea in mind that you could just look at the images pretty fast and get an instant read on them. They weren't images that were impossible to interpret and people could just respond quickly, like, I like that one. And, but if, as you chose that one, then there's a question on the back and you have to answer the question to get the postcard, right? And um, we've gotten 500 answers so far. We expect about 1,500 answers eventually. And then we're analyzing answers and going to find out sort of what's buried in this like who decided your gender okay so what are all the answers are going to be put into the hopper and we're going to find out what people think about that question of the show giving the uh, kind of subtext of the piece. So it's in English, Spanish, and Mandarin. Those are some of the most commonly spoken languages in LA County. And my mother helped translate the Chinese for us, which is great. So we translated into Chinese when we showed it in um, Shenyang, China in 2014. So we're really happy to be part of the show. I see it's very bodily heavy, very text, textual, which is interesting given uh, Judith Butler's work on gender, which has kind of evolved into this idea of the social body, the precariat. Um, I'm just kind of thinking about what that means. Like, you know, for years people tried to evade the body, and so I'm not sure what that means. 